Hey everyone, I'm Vitor Santos and I'm the project lead and editor on this product. The team was comprised of myself, Trey Redden, Sam Carella, Christopher Flores Santos, Jonathan Glennon. So the project was designing and developing a command line instruction program for the spectrum analysis videos for Robbins Air Force Base. As an overview of the project, the main functionality of the product is to receive video footage in the form of MP4s, convert that data into values the program can parse, and output values such as peak and average amplitude, frequencies, and timestamps from MP4s into a CSV file. The tool would allow users to search and automatically filter the CSV file based on user input that corresponds with what they are looking for in the data. The sample data provided to us was similar enough in format that we could split the functionality of the project into multiple components to help facilitate production. With all these components though, another goal of the product was to package all the functionality into an easy to use EXE so as to meet the requirements and not need access to the internet. The tools we used for this product was Python as the base language as it has a variety of libraries that we can use to help facilitate development such as OpenCV, a computer vision library that provides most of the functionality of the video processing component. Pandas is our data solution to create the CSV file and NumPy is what we were using to do the actual analysis of the data came, coming from OpenCV. We opted for a lightweight command line interface that will take in the MP4 file using a package called ARG Parse. The package is great because it allows us to use the command line and prompt users without much issue. And it provided a minimal performance impact for potential videos being multiple hours long. For object detection, our main library that we used was OpenCV. It allowed us to isolate the graph through a variety of functions as well as break down the information for NumPy to access later. For the demo of the product, we decided to include two different uh, videos of the functionality to showcase the program working with two slightly different videos. The first one being the uh, main testing device, but uh, the second one here shows a slightly different grid, a slightly different angle, and we're still able to access the data through the program by utilizing OpenCV's uh, functionality here. After this analysis is done, it will output the values into CSV, which, like I said before, can be filtered by the program according to what the user needs. And that's it for our presentation. Thank you.